Warning, this fucking video is not for kids. <laughs> Give me a beer, you fucking dog. Alright, this is Billy Bob Tanley here, people, and this is a request from Flush Your Washer, and it was uploaded by Penguin Zero, and the name of this video is, This Will Make Your Family Hate You. Okay, let's check it out. Yay. I think now is the easiest time in Why is he wearing glasses here? Parent. Back in the earlier days, Gee, to make sure your kid didn't hmm. fall off a cliff good? or get hit by a stray arrow, mauled oh. by a lion, you know, fall victim to the century on the Oregon Trail. Oh. It was tough to be a parent back then, but now I think it's super easy because you can just give your kid an iPad and let the internet raise them for you, and then oh, you get mad when well, your I'm kid glad I don't is have exactly kids. an upstanding citizen and blame I'm everyone but yourself. That shit. But for parents that want to be a little more involved in their kids' lives, luckily there are some great departments that are offering invaluable knowledge on how to be the worst possible Search your child's ever. room. This is coming from the OC Sheriff, who posted this tweet. Do you know how to properly search your child's room? If not, stick around for our first episode of Hashtag Parent Aware with Sergeant what Gunsley. I think there is a 0% chance Gunsley. this guy's name is actually Gunsley. This has to be an alias. It's too fitting. Fucking Sergeant Gunsley. What do you guys Never think next? That Parent Aware episode 2 is hosted by Bill Bazooka. Fucking Paul Danger. Like, goddamn. Weird name. I'm Sergeant Brian Gunsley with the Orange County Sheriff's Department. And today I'm going to show you how to search your child's room. Wow. The first step Invasion of the to privacy, too. The child, or the teenager in this case. Uh, from the room. You don't want them in the room because their protests may distract well, you Well, if you think they're up to something like they're hiding drugs, I guess you need to room. do something, though. Thanks. We'll talk later. Wow. Parent aware. He's the oldest episode. teenager of all time. Dude looks like he's going on 40 years old. Like, who is this? <laughs> Benjamin Button? Jesus Christ. Dude's got like a thick 5 o'clock shadow. I yeah, like how he's immediately teenager. treating his son like a criminal. Like, hey, pal. I'm gonna need you to get the fuck out of here. I'm surprised you didn't like kick down the door, weapon drawn, like get on the ground. I'm searching the room. He might as well. Him anyway, just for the sake of it, like you're not gonna interrupt. It's important to search your child's room every once in a while, like I would say about every six months, unless you suspect that they're using drugs or alcohol. Yeah, unless you're, you're suspect. More often. He treats his household like it's boot camp. All right, champ, it's time for your weekly room inspection. Go report to Corporal Hollow Point well, and give kids me 500 drugs. push before you eat your green bean casserole. It sucks that they gotta so be I don't think I need to explain like to you why doing this is a horrible violation of your kid's privacy and it is kinda absolutely is, going to yeah. lead to a lot of problems in your relationship. This is a lose family. lose situation, but I think folks. I'll explain it anyway. Anyone who's ever been a kid, which I'm assuming is everyone except this guy, this guy, I guess, <laughs> was just created in a lab to be the most generic NPC <laughs> police officer ever yeah. fucking captain america over here never had a childhood anyone who did knows how awful kids it have to have their to privacy your parents don't trust you you want to walk in on your son spanking his monkey do you want to see that shit do not trust them and it <laughs> makes you resent them so what i'm sure it's happened to start searching from top to bottom and then left to right so here i would start searching in search for weed this plant and then go across to the right and then <sighs> to whatever um, containers well, are here. Well, it's also their right to go investigate the parents' room. And inspect things thoroughly. See, here we have a container with, looks like a place for someone to hide something. So I'm uh -oh. going to hang on to that. Certainly want to already fuck it up. talk about that in a little bit. What a weird item of interest. It's just an empty bottle. Like, that's super normal. What do you mean you're going to have a talk with them about that? What this is so dumb. Look like? Come here, son. Look, I found it. That empty bottle of vitamin gummies. Bet you're using it to store drugs, aren't you? He's been putting cocaine co co in that shit. Better than this. Get out of my house. Um, when it comes to books, you just want to search through. All you got search for this porn this collection. Thing. Here we have a picture. It looks like of a child with a gun to their head. Um, this may. What the fuck? That, um, they're thinking about committing suicide. So that's something that we want to talk about. What the heck? Yeah, that sounds about part so of the course. Up. If my dad was like this, I'd probably have stick figure drawings of a gun to my head as well. If you're the kind of parent that's actually going to follow this advice and routinely this kick so their kids out of their boof. room so you can thoroughly search it like you're looking for a fucking treasure map, you should go in expecting something like this. Some cries for help to let you know that they're I don't want to tell you. I also really like the background music here. The I hope he's not doing drugs. Facebook shit really helps elevate the tutorial. So here, oh, here we have something. Uh, this looks like is that a, a diary? Some sort. S scale so disguised as a video game um, by someone who's maybe purchasing drugs or selling drugs. 
so that's something that's disguised. We'll hang on to that. Uh, Pretty fucking cool scale, but it makes it feel like this whole thing was filmed in 1998. Why the fuck would someone made. disguise a scale as a PlayStation 1 video game? You draw more attention with that than anything else. Like, that is some old school shit. I have shit. no advice. Obviously, this is all set up for the tutorial here, but I like to imagine it all is real. Why is your mic set, Mark Fayette? into his son's room. Get the fuck out, I'm searching for contraband, and this is the result. So, like, in that case, I feel like his son is innocent, and Sergeant Guns is framing him. Like, he's setting him up. This definitely belongs to an older man. There's no way a kid who's selling yeah. drugs is disguising their scale as PlayStation 1 Tetris. No <laughs> chance. But that does seem like something an out-of-touch <laughs> Still invasion of privacy, but... try and bust people undercover. <sighs> parading around. I do love these video games, am I right, kids? We love Tetris and PlayStation, right? Oh, yeah, he's gonna find his porn, isn't he? Just fell out. That's super weird. No one's a cop here, right? Like, you guys wouldn't want to buy this, would you? Looks like a container. Monster energy. Sort. Let's see what's inside. It's not a container, it's a can. Here. We have some, looks like marijuana. Oh boy. So I am going to hang on That's to That's the most evil thing in the world. That. Some teens <laughs> use this to get high. They can use this as a huffing device. So I don't smoke marijuana. But dust off or any, any type of uh, there's worse drugs than that. We want to remove that because that could be used as something uh, dangerous and that could be dangerous. <laughs> Imagine Sergeant Gunsley just hits a mean whip it on camera. Kids use this to get high. And so do I. <laughs> that would be funny. Fucking great. Now, this is the first yeah. thing he's done that seems reasonable to me. You know, keyboard cleaner is very dangerous. You don't want that anywhere around your kids. And I just don't think he went far. Yeah, you definitely don't want your kids smoking it. there's a window it. right there. That's extremely dangerous. His kid at any moment could throw himself through that window and kill himself. So I think you need to put some bars on the window to keep them safe. And maybe yeah, put some bars there. A little bit because we don't want him to, like, hit the wall kind of hard and hurt himself. <laughs> yeah, just, put I some think plastic we should start taking sponge. a little more inspiration from the uh, isolation units. Put a dog collar on and he goes so far away, it zaps. If your first thought upon going into your kid's room and seeing keyboard cleaner is, oh my god, they must be using this to get high, then you so have already fast. utterly failed as a parent and something has gone awry. <sighs> this cop's just searching through everything. You gonna find his condoms? And also it's very important his to be respectful too. of the child's property. Yeah, Sergeant Gunsley, very respectful. He's over here acting like Mr. Krabs on the panty raid. <laughs> Just going through all of like his boxers and shit, like looking for anything in his pockets. Yeah, that's the first so thing So much wrong well. on every part. He's being. Here we have some more clothing. Looks like everything's okay there. Oh, I have a pipe. A pop. Or, uh -oh. inside some socks. We smoked crack. Uh, Ajax. I don't know why this would be in the, in his room. So I would inspect that a little what better. What the fuck? In fact, here we have another container. That With we nothing in it. About. And certainly you want to collect all these items. Uh, they shouldn't have them in their room. Good lord, who's his son? Cobra Commander? What's he gonna pull out <laughs> next? A golden AK-47 from under his bed? Yeah, you see that shit. Really the There's a problem. Here. And here I have a couple of little baggies. It looks like they may have had some drugs in them or something. Oh my point. god. So that's another indicator. In the pursuit of much, locating huh? drugs in his son's room, no price is too high. Sergeant Gunsley even starts tugging on his son's crusty cum sock just to look <laughs> for more clues of drugs. He's like Scooby Doo, <laughs> but really gross. This is all gross. Mountain Dew. Suspicious. So this looks like it might be something. I'm familiar with, with this as a <laughs> container. So Everything's a container to you. People can buy online these hidden compartments. Oh, okay. So as, as you can what see, the fuck? it has liquid above and below, but the container, it's a false, uh, you know. I've never seen there. nothing like that. People can hide things in there. This part really just felt like an ad for that Mountain Dew secret container That's there. what that was. That shit looked awesome. And Officer Gunsley comes in hot. He's like, yeah, you can find this online. And then I half expected him to drop a link to his own blog. Like, yeah, you can find this online at GunsleyCraft. Yeah, that's what that was. To purchase one. Journals are good to, to go through. Um, as a parent, they're... You have every right to search your child's room. There is no legal problem with that. So be sure to take advantage of that and search your child's God. room while well, they're under the age. I don't want to I'm just glad I'm um, not a parent. Here, you know, we just want to take a look through 
um, the journal and just see if there's anything suspicious. But that wasn't a five-year-old room you're searching either. It looks like they're That's a 40-year-old teenager. On here. If you have to be reassured that what you're doing <laughs> isn't technically illegal, then it's probably very immoral. And you're not exactly the hero in the story. Nobody's but a hero to be here, fair, man. We were able to locate some crayon doodles of weed in a journal. So yeah, really it's the time to rest in that. The means, and now we know our son is not only a criminal, but an extremely untalented one when it comes to art. <laughs> this, this is a highlighter. God, I hate which this. Appears to be a highlighter, but this is something that can be purchased online. And what it is is uh -oh. a pipe, and it just what the fuck? hides within. The highlighter. Well, if any of you kids that's watching this video have shit like that, you're all Nothing fucked. Nothing gets past the keen eyes of Officer Gunsley. Don't the be doing drugs. Mission. Not even the Inspector Gadget crack pipe was enough to get by him. What another cool little gadget, which he again mentions you can find online. <laughs> yeah, he can, anything can like be a drug. To be fair. But goddamn. I'll that would be like the example. last thing I suspect would be like a fucking highlighter right in the trash. I wouldn't think to like go to the secret ass end of it and look for a crack pipe. Fucking Everything can be disguised, I guess. Somehow he knows about it. God damn. He's too good. Yeah, fucking smash on to you. Research like this because you want to know whether or not they're using drugs. Best way to prevent adult addiction is to intervene <sighs> early when they're young. So this is the time yeah. to prevent a lifelong uh, struggle with addiction. Why you gonna come back to his room? Lifelong resentment of you, their parents. <laughs> this also isn't going to prevent a struggle with addiction. This may only reinforce an yeah, addiction. Yeah, you're gonna investigate this is everything. This just an all-around horrible idea for parents everywhere. Yeah, uh, thanks, know. Orange County you Sheriff, <laughs> and thank you, Officer Gunsley, for showing Fuck us exactly up. how to be the worst fucking dad that you can be. That's how I see it. So there you go, everyone. If y'all want to watch the original video, the link is in the description. Go check it out and shit. I'm getting the fuck out here, so yeah. My name is Billy Bob Tanley, and I approve this message.